Hi, this is Nate Miller from Proving Ground. In this video I'm going to provide you with a short overview on how to install and set up Conductor. Conductor is a series of plugins and add-ins that allow you to connect Rhino and Revit into Trello's project management system. Conductor comes through a click once installer. After you accept the terms of the end user license agreement, you'll be presented with a splash screen where you can select different plugins to install. Conductor currently ships for Revit 2015, 2016, and 2017, as well as Rhino 5. If you don't have some of these applications, the checkboxes will appear gray and unchecked and you won't be able to install them. You can only install Conductor for applications that you have. I'm going to click on Install and, you'll be prompt, and I'll be prompted here to uh, enter in my license key. I'm just going to paste in my license key and hit Submit. The installer will then say that my license has been validated. I'm going to hit OK and it will then tell me that selected plugins were installed. After you receive this message, your plugin should be ready to use in any of the tools that you've installed Conductor for. After you've installed Conductor for the first time, you need to connect the app to your Trello account. I'm in Revit 2016, so I'm going to go up to the Proving Ground tab and find Conductor 1.0. When you launch the app for the first time, you'll see that the Trello User Setup tab has been expanded. You need to follow these three steps in order to connect the app to Trello. Step one is to get a token from Trello. This is how the app will know that it's connected to your account. So I'm going to click Get Token from Trello, and it's going to take me to the website. This is going to ask me to let Conductor to use my account. You can see that the app uh, will be able to read all of your boards, create and update cards, make comments for you, etc. I'm going to click Allow, and then I'm going to be given this token. I need to copy and paste this token into Conductor. Back in Conductor, I need to paste this into Step 2, and then click Authorize. You can now see that it's logged in as me and that my organizations are now available. And I can now start clicking through and selecting different boards, different lists, and different tasks.